Well, hello everybody. Wendy Elaine Wright, Talent Manager. I thought I'd give you an idea of the kind of auditions and bookings my clients are getting so you could see what's possible for you. Um, when you follow the direction of a manager, it really helps when they're helping guide you and coach you on how to train, where to train, where to get your headshots, um, what kind of classes you should be taking, who you should take them with, how to build your resume, um, to make it stand out to casting directors and to make you impressive, how to meet casting directors, how to stay in touch with casting directors, how to audition, um, what you should not do in auditions, what you should do in auditions, what is a callback, how to handle a callback, how to handle the job, when to join SAG. There's like so many questions. Um, and a lot of times when you're really, really, really brand new, you can't interest a manager because you just can't make them any money. And you know, most managers are not going to take on brand new people who, who can't make them any money. And unfortunately, I try to, you know, I try to take on as many newcomers as I can and try to help them. But that's why I wrote the book, because I can't help everybody. And I, I certainly can't make a living off of people who don't make me any money. Right. So I just got this really nice email from this girl. I'm trying to sign in so I can show it to you. Um, I'm going to sign in real quick and. and then I'll read it to you, but, but um, I'm not going to take her on, and you'll see why I can't take her on. Uh, she's very sweet. Let's see. Where is she? Here she is. New submission. <sighs> Sorry, girl, but I can't do this. Um, you know, I hate this new new Yahoo. You can, like, your messages are all stacked. Ah. Anyway, hello, my name is blank. I'm a 17-year-old actress. I am very interested in getting representation from WAW Entertainment. I'm currently taking an acting class at College of the Canyons while I finish my senior year of high school, which I think is really pretty cool. She's taking an acting class at the college while she's finishing her senior year. Let's go get her. I like that. Also, I am starting private lessons with Diane Christensen very soon, and hopefully her teen acting class as well. I've grown up around the inter entertainment industry, and I know that's where I want to be. I'm very hardworking and now looking for representation to help me pursue acting 100% and further my acting career as far as I possibly can. I've attached my headshot and resume. I look forward to hopefully hearing back from you. Thank you. Her name, her email address, her resume at actorsaccess.com, and a cute picture. So here's a lot of problems with this. Um, the fact that she's 17, I mean, listen, until she's 18, that's a hard sell for sure because they want to hire 18-year-olds to play 15 and 16. And they're not going to hire 17-year-olds to play 15 or 16, okay? Because then you need a set teacher and all that other stuff. So until she turns 18, she's a hard sell. Second, her resume, when I type it up, it's very, very, very not going to help her. She has small, it's, it literally says small school plays three, Vince's pasta and pizza commercial, and acting at the fundamentals, acting fundamentals at the College of the Canyons. There's nothing I can do with her. I, nothing, nothing, nothing I will do with her. Because I have 25 other clients who I'm getting working and booking, and I'm going to tell you in a minute what they're working and booking. But the sweet, beautiful girl, I appreciate your email, but you have so much work to do to build your resume. I mean, you have so much work to do to build your resume. You've got to... You got to do some. You got to go really get get like get on it on Actors Access and submit yourself for every short, every student film, non-union film, uh, webisode, every project you can get. I mean, with this kind of resume, I couldn't sell you to anybody. I don't care how cute you are, and you're cute. You have a great smile. You're a pretty blonde girl, pretty eyes. But there are so many people in L.A. who are pretty girls with pretty eyes and pretty smiles and all that stuff. If I sent this resume to someone, they would just laugh at me and throw it out the door. you know. And I would never send this resume to anybody. When a client comes to me and I sign them, uh, we spend the first year or so, and they have to come with me with a lot more experience than this. But they'd have to spend, you know, at least getting five or six student films and short films under their belt, a couple of webisodes, and way more theater than she's done, and a lot more training than she's had. I mean, this 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 girl is nowhere near ready for me. That's why I wrote my book, because if she picks up the book, it'll teach her exactly how she could become marketable to a manager, how she could become marketable to an agent, how she could be interesting to a casting director. At this point, she wouldn't be interesting to anybody. And that's just the real reality. I mean, there's like 20,000 actors here every year. 
why would she stand out? She doesn't stand out. She doesn't have enough experience. So, you know, I have to unfortunately turn her down. And of course I do that always in a kind and loving way, which is like, go get my book, go learn how to build your, your resume. So let's talk about what my clients have been doing. Woohoo! Um, all of these actors that I introduced agents to, Chelsea signed commercially with Mink Talent Agency. Rachel signed commercially with Rage. Jenny signed theatrically and commercially across the board with Across the Board Talent Agency. I love them over there. Um, Maggie signed commercially with Envy Agency. Tierra signed with um, Howard Talent Agency. Asia signed across the board with Howard Talent West. Adriana signed across the board with Media Artist Group. Reese signed with AVO Talent Agency. Sarah Ann signed with um, Prodigy Talent Agency. David Stevens, I got signed to Howard Talent West. Noah, I got signed to... Um, Across the board with Jamie Farrar Agency, Lindy with AVO Talent Agency, Tara with KSR, Savannah with Howard Talent West, Thea with um, Allensworth. So I love introducing all my clients to agents. They all get signed to agents. And I'm working right now on a couple more that I have that need to get signed to agents. Love it when they get their first agent, you know. But then once you get your agent, boy, you better have, be on the ball. I'm telling you, I usually don't even introduce my clients to agents until they have all their materials together. So auditions. They've been auditioning for... Match.com, Toyota, Nike, Mattel, LG Smart, Chevron, Little Caesars Pizza, Bose, Unique Clo, Honda, Panasonic, Uno, Red Robin, Xbox, GoDaddy.com, Adidas, Slip and Slide, Taco Bell, Visa, Old Navy, Natural Sunscreen, Home Depot, Intel, Men's Speed Stick, SeaWorld, Payless Shoes, Microsoft, Megablocks, Charter, Puma, Sears, Coca-Cola, Six Flags, Disney, Cisco Sprint, DeVry, Interval, Honda, Peachtree, Financial, Dodge Dart which my dad had when I was a kid growing up. We had a white Dodge Dart parked in front of our house, and even after it stopped working, it was parked there for years. I loved that car. Ah, my childhood. Anyway, Pediasure, Boeing, Olive Garden, Samsung, C22, Megatoys, Kia, Humulin, Ford, McDonald's, Tide, Buick, Newcastle Beer, Burger King, Mathnasium, Spin Master, Burlington, Coat Factory, and more. Now that's just commercials. Let's talk about the features and the indies and the shorts and the sags and the student films. First of all, my client Noah booked a pilot, so I'm so excited for him with Nickelodeon. Woo woo! Everybody wants their, their actors on pilots, believe me. <clears throat> Gratefully booked a pilot. M Morgan booked a pilot. Um, just love when my clients book things. Okay. Grown Ups 2. Here's the movies. Grown Ups 2, Job's Daughter, Once Upon a Tale, Modern Day Princess, Eternally Mad, After Hours, that can go on and on and on because there's so many. Maid of Honor, I think Maggie just booked Maid of Honor um, and got to meet one of my favorite actors, um, which I just, you know, I'm spacing on his name right now, but he, was, he played that doctor who was like, saw his dead wife and his name is Patrick something and all those uh, horror movies and she just sent me a picture of herself with him. God, he's beautiful. Anywho... At the Zoo, The Settlement, Brothers in Trouble, Love Pieces, Clockmaker, Hollywood Nights, Ghost World, Employees with Benefits, Fond of You. There's just on and on and on and on and on. Um, another one booked a Nickelodeon pilot, an A&E pilot, and a Buck Cherry video. Let's continue. Tierra booked a Sony commercial. <clears throat> I just said Morgan booked an A&E pilot, but she also booked a Microsoft commercial and the lead in a short film to Lawrence and the lead in another short film called That Face. Um, Noah booked the lead in two short films. Megan booked a commercial, and she auditioned for Scandal. Jason booked a role in the film Desolate Road, which was selected to the Scream Fest Horror Film Festival, and he booked another role in a short film called Desert Noir, which was selected to the short festival, and he shot a small role in the film Beneath with Jeff Fahey, who I grew up with watching on TV. Ryan booked four shorts, a commercial, a role in a feature film with Eric Roberts and Doris Roberts, and he just booked a role on the History Channel show. Patrick's uh, short film Insomniac is at multiple film festivals. My client Elisa is touring the world with Prince in the new Power Generation. Um, Asia just booked a Boeing commercial. She's done two student films, a music video. She just auditioned for Broadway and Annie. Um, She's done a whole bunch of theater in L.A., the South Pacific, Annie, the Fall, Fall, Fall Troy, a Hard Knock Life, Joseph, Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat with Lorenzo Lamas. Tierra booked an episode of America's Court. Oops, there are actors on America's Court. That's why I don't watch that one, because that's not one, that's not real like Judge Judy, okay? The actors go on America's Court, and they act out 
the roles of what really happened. So that drives me nuts. I can't watch that one. But I'm glad she booked it. Uh, Jenna, she booked the role in several web series. The Ploy, The Watchers, Office Jerks, and she's producer on a short film. Mary Alex booked the lead in a short film. Brooklyn booked a television PSA. Brittany booked a modeling campaign in Miami, which got paid a hell of a lot of money for. Um, Patty booked a USC film called Trista. Reese booked a role in the film Medicine Man, which has been going to con, which went to con. Lauren was cast in uh, The Prop, a, a SAG short called Love in the Afternoon. She's dancing in a music video for Keanu Rene. Lindsay booked a SAG after a ultra low budget film. Sarah booked a role in the Hollywood musical No Time to Weep. I love it. My clients are booking, they're working. And let me tell you, when they came to me, they had some theater on their resume and a couple films here and there. But my goal as the manager is to make sure they fill their resume out. I mean, I immediately look at their resume and I go, holy cow, like I just looked at that one. You need more credits on here. You need to go build your student films, your feature films, commercials, um, your webisodes, and you need to get training. You need to train with these people. That's going to look really good on your resume and it's going to give you the skills you need. And I put everything I know in my ebook, Secrets of a Hollywood Talent Manager, and I walk a client like right through the process. So if that girl buys the book, she's going to look at it and she's going to say, okay, my, my headshots are not so good. I need to get these kind of looks. I need to know what my type is and I need to get great headshots. She only had two up there and they were really shitty. But she was pretty, but her headshots just really were not good. And they wouldn't stand out of a pile of a thousand, I promise you. So she'd have to change that right away. Um, and then she'd have to upload five or six pictures. You know, I'm not going to tell you every single thing you need to do. I wrote it all down in my ebook. And for God's sake, go buy it because it's going to change your life. And I think that every single actor coming to L.A. should have this book. It should be like the go-to book. Period. It'll, it'll give you exactly what you need to do to get to the level where I would actually consider taking you on as a client and where any of my colleagues, managers, and agents would be impressed by your resume. So good luck out there today. Keep fighting the good fight. Like I always say, if you come here to be an actor, follow your dreams, follow your heart, never give up. You've been given a great talent and an amazing gift to share with the world. And you know what? When you share it, you make everyone's life better. We get to go relax from the mayhem of life and sit in the movie theater and laugh or cry or experience humanity. And we get to sit in TVs at our home and TV and just laugh and, and just be present with the beauty of life because you actors are a blessing to our planet. And that's why you're so revered. And that's why when you're famous and rich, you make so much freaking money because we love you. And as a manager, I love you. So go follow your dreams, buy my book. Please don't, don't waste time. If that girl gets my book today and starts following it, she's gonna, in a year, she's gonna have like an amazing resume, some great training, great experience, all her marketing materials together, and then she'll be in, interesting to someone like me. Um, anyway, that's it for now. Follow me on Facebook. Uh, just look for WAW Entertainment. You can like me, I mean. You can follow me on Twitter, WAW underscore Wendy. And um, look below if you want to buy my book. There's a link. And let me know how you like the book. After you read it, I would love to hear, you know, how it's going. I'd love to see, like, who you're signing with. And I'd like, I've given you nine agents in the book that actually sign new people um, with their email addresses and everything. So all you have to do is I've, I've given you a cover letter in my book, too. Just cut and paste the cover letter into your email. Add your headshots and resume. Um, send it to the nine agents I've given you and you're likely going to get an agent. I mean, they're great, great commercial agents and they get my clients out. Um, that's it. Enjoy your life and take this thing one day at a time. Always have faith in yourself and keep going. Talk to you soon and I love you. Bye.